Bobby Broyles along with Jamie Corrin are back here for the women's edition of CA Hoops Weekly presented by Under Armour. To recap what was a great atmosphere in Harrisonburg Thursday night as the JMU Dukes were able to get past the Virginia Tech Hokies and advance to the quarterfinals of the WNIT. That's right, Bobby. Talk about an amazing atmosphere at the Convocation Center as the Dukes dug deep to knock off Virginia Tech. JMU trailed late before two Kamaya Smalls free throws gave the Dukes the lead and Ania Young came up with a huge block to seal the victory. With the win, James Madison is into the WNIT quarterfinals for the fourth time in program history. The Dukes will continue to march on this Sunday at 2 on CA.TV. It will be the quarterfinal round of the WNIT from the Convocation Center as the JMU Dukes will host the Georgetown Hoyas out of the Big East. Yes, and this is a familiar face, Bobby, as JMU hosted Georgetown on November 16th, earning a 69-57 win, one of JMU's 17 home wins this year. The Dukes pulled away in the fourth quarter in that win, outscoring Georgetown 24-13 in the game's final 10 minutes. Jackie Benitez led JMU with 17 points, while Kamaya Smalls added 16 in that win. Overall, the Dukes have won 30 straight games at the Convocation Center, the third best active home court winning streak in the NCAA. Georgetown reached the quarterfinals with a 53-46 win at Providence on Tuesday. Diana White, a 2,000-point scorer at Georgetown, had 19 points in the victory. CASports.com will have all the information you need regarding links to live stats, video, and audio coverage of Sunday afternoon's contest. You can also follow Sunday's game and other news around the league on Facebook and Instagram by searching CAA Sports. We're also on Twitter at CAA Basketball using the hashtag CAA Hoops. That is it from us today. Good luck to the Dukes and enjoy the game, everyone.